Can you introduce yourself for us? I'm Jerry Haas, the men's golf coach at Wake Forest University, being interviewed by the associate head golf coach here, Aaron O'Callaghan, and uh, looking forward to doing a little interview with you, Aaron. Thank you. So, Coach, um, do you have a favorite sports movie? Yeah, that's pretty easy for me. It's uh, Field of Dreams with uh, Kevin Costner. Uh, everybody's seen it. You know, if, if you build it, he will come. Uh, there's an ending scene where um, he never really knew the whole movie, why he was building this field. And you have the White Sox, Shoeless Joe showing up and Smokey Joe Wood, you know, and all these guys playing and uh, Mel Ott and all these great guys that I kind of never saw play but heard their names. And uh, they play, obviously, in this field that no one can see. But at the end, he truly built it so his father, who was the catcher the whole time, that uh, Ray Kinsilla, and uh, he had a falling out with his dad. And uh, at the end, they have a game of catch. So um, I used to throw with my dad all the time. So really uh, an emotional movie for me, but yet uh, so well done. And um, you know, James Earl Jones was fantastic as well. And uh, uh, just really, really cool movie. Incredible detail. You, you obviously seem like a sports movie fan and um, are, are able to connect and recall very vividly, I guess, a lot of movies uh, from knowing you as, as well. How do, how do you feel like athletes are represented in sports movies? Uh, I think in movies like anything, um, I think it's a little bit, um, they don't show the behind the scenes, if you will, of what an athlete really goes through to achieve their success. Um, a lot of times you'll, you'll see a movie and it all just looks like it's so easy and uh, success comes so easy, but it really doesn't. If you look at any great athlete in any sport, they've really had to work um, to overcome a lot of times uh, their environment they've grown up in, um, their family life, um, their inabilities to do certain things they've had to work to become better at it. And uh, I think a lot of times the movie kind of glides over that a little bit, but you only have two hours to get it done and trying to send the message. But um, uh, I know as a professional golfer all my life and being around uh, uh, professional athletes in my family that uh, there is a lot of work that goes in behind the scenes. So um, it's great theater, but at the same time for me, it's a little bit, doesn't tell the whole picture. Great. And Coach, do you have a favorite sports movie scene or, or TV scene? Boy, there's, uh, there's a lot of them. Uh, I love in Hoosiers with um, where uh, Gene Hackman takes him to the state high school final, just this little town of Hickory, Indiana. And um, he, he's been this coach that uh, had a troubled past, but he's, he's resurrected this little high school in Indiana. And I grew up in Illinois, so I can relate a little bit to the Indiana-Illinois basketball scene. And he takes him into the gym and he brings the tape measure and they get on each other's shoulders and he measures the basket and shows them it's 10 feet. And basically saying, sure, we're going to be playing here in this big gym in front of all these people. It's the state high school, you know, finals and all that. But the, the hoop is still the same. It's the same as in your driveway or at the little gym that you played in Hickory. So I thought that was a great, uh, great scene by Gene Hackman. Wonderful, Coach. Thank you for your time. Uh, my pleasure.